Chicago police caught on camera behaving badly, this time in Pittsburgh. The officers were there working security for the G20 summit last month. Now they are the subject of an internal affairs investigation. Craig Wall joins us now live from police headquarters with more on what the officers supposedly did. Craig. Yeah, Robin, it's hard to figure out what the officers were thinking when they arrested a young man and then forced him to pose for a picture. Chicago police are trying to determine what, if any, general orders the officers violated. But while that is being sorted out, the department is dealing with another caught-on-camera embarrassment. The video, which circulated widely on YouTube, shows Chicago police in riot gear forcing a handcuffed young man to kneel in the street while they crowd around behind him for a picture during the G20 summit in Pittsburgh. A white-shirted sergeant or higher-ranking officer then takes the photo. It is appalling to see that we have these uh, seemingly rent-a-riot cops who co go to another city from Chicago and get their souvenir photo taken with a protester who's handcuffed. Michael McConnell has been involved with dozens of protests and demonstrations in Chicago over the years. He says, unfortunately, the video is not that surprising. The arrestee is 21-year-old University of Pittsburgh student Kyle Kramer. His attorney says Kramer was not a protester, but just a student walking back to campus after getting a pizza. The officers were part of a contingent of 150 Chicago cops who went on their off time to assist during the G20 summit. The department issued a statement saying the Chicago Police Department does not tolerate misconduct by any of its members, regardless of where it might occur. Should they be fired for this? Yes, they should be fired for that. Why not? I'll get fired if I did something stupid like that at my job, you know. Maybe suspended for a little bit, but not fired. In today's day and age, when there seems to be video cameras almost everywhere, many people wonder what made the officers think they could get away with behavior like this without consequences. I don't think any of those guys are going to be nominated for any brightness awards anytime soon. Chicago police could not tell me if the officers have been taken off the streets pending the investigation or how long that investigation might take. Live at Chicago Police Headquarters, Craig Wall, Fox Chicago News.